Every year at Carnegie Mellon we have a solo competition and for this competition instrumentalists from every single department come and play for myself and for the other music directors of the Wind Ensemble. And this year we had a terrific crop and out of this we have a terrific winner, um, Algadas from Lithuania who won on euphonium and he is the first euphonium player to win in the six years that we've done this and he really did a marvelous job. I try to do most of my playing early in the mornings when nobody's around. You know, I feel like there's a different level of focus and intensity to the practice when it's quiet. There's no rush, no stress in the surroundings, and all the tension can be targeted towards becoming better. So there are thousands of notes in the piece I play, and I make sure every single one gets worked on to the point where I'm not restricted by the technicality of playing. No matter how difficult the piece is, I want to make sure that it's not just a player of the people seeing on the stage, but rather a musician when it comes to time to perform. Also, it's pretty cool because by the time people start their day, I've already done a huge portion of my work, so that's kind of rewarding. I am fortunate enough to be the one conducting Algodos for the concert, and we are performing a piece by Philip Spark um, called Harlequin, and it is an extremely technical, flashy piece. Now to prepare for this, we have a multi-step process. The first step is Al Gadas and I got together about two weeks ago and discussed what was going to happen musically, because I needed to hear his ideas um, figure out what his tempi were going to be, see when he was slowing down, when he was speeding up. And we had a terrific meeting and he sounded absolutely fantastic. The second step is I got together with just the musicians of the ensemble and rehearsed them without Algardas to make sure that we knew what we were doing. The third step is to bring the soloist in to rehearse with the ensemble. And for this particular piece, we brought Algardas in a little bit early because the piece is so difficult. Um, from a technical standpoint, the, the tempi are so fast. It's digga 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 And it takes a lot to coordinate 40 musicians and a soloist to get everybody to play that fast together. slow but at least uh, things go really really fast they have to work as a team just listen 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 but it sounded pretty good uh, no doubt about it and uh, pull it off really well by the time concert comes and the last step is we're going to have an absolutely magnificent concert on april 2nd in carnegie music hall at 4 30 and if you can't make it to carnegie music hall it'll also be live streamed so please come check us out